that building there is uh, a holiday home. It's used in the summer, summer months. This is the beginnings of my fruit garden here. These ones here are raspberries. They're only young plants, these. These ones are black currants in this row. And in this row are gooseberries. That tree there is an oak tree. Most of the trees in this area are oak, about 99% of them. And there's a couple of conifers. They're about uh, 80, 90 years old. The hedge along that side is um, blackthorn, sloes. This area of the garden here is uh, devoted to fruit trees. There are lots of young fruit trees in here. Apples, pears, cherry trees. And on the hedge at the far end there's a, a, an apple tree. It has loads of apples on it. This is um, a hazel. Hawthorn here and a couple of plum trees. It's growing up the back of the barn there is uh, that's a grapevine. And those trees there are um, damson trees. There's a gas tank, the white thing. No gas in it, because it's not connected up to the house yet. This tree here is a pear tree. But the, tr the pears are inedible. stone wall that's along here. This building here is a, a workshop. It contains a bread oven as well. An old fashioned bread oven. As you can see this building here is absolutely covered in ivy which is in flower at the moment so it's buzzing with bees. There is a rhododendron which I brought from my home in uh, from my house in Luton. So it's a little bit of uh, Bedfordshire in the middle of France.